Okay. Um, Madlock, Mad Madrock Madlock device. Uh, just a utility carabiner. It's an HMS locking beaner. You're gonna set this system up in your harness. Clip in just like that. Take a bite of rope and pinch it through. The important thing is if I'm going to be pulling from this side, I want it on the opposite side, opposite slot. Okay? And then from here, normally for repelling, you stick it through there, or you belay like that. But if you want it in cinch mode, you take your locking beaner, clip it through, always lock your beaner. And then what you have here a system that allows you to take slack out but does not let it go the other way so slack out now the other way okay in terms of yo-yo lock your beaner always got it installed that way here's where you have your pulley mechanical ascender if you had a pulley sorry it's not a pulley obviously stand up take the slack out does not let slack go through stand up Slack out, does not go through. Okay, it's, we're now done ascending. Time to come back down to transition to rappel. All you gotta do, take the weight off of this, take another uh, beaner, push this through, boom, just like that. Take the beaner, clip it to your harness, and clip it through both that and that. Remove this. Pop it in, now you're ready to repel. And then once you start repelling, this will take the weight off of the beaner um, that was connecting at the beginning, and you can uh, take that off. Or take it off altogether. Alright? So pretty safe, you still maintain some sort of attachment via this, and then you come down. Whoosh, whoosh. Another technique um, that I've played around with that works involves two locking beaners. And you're just going to clip them in, not opposed. Maybe, there we go. Into your uh, belay loop or your attachment point on your harness. Have them like this. You're going to take the rope and you're going to push it through like this. So the tail is coming out the front. Push it through. Then you're gonna take this, you're gonna bring it around, and you're gonna put it through the back one. So you have something like that. Now always lock your beaner. And now you have a system that you can pull up, lock off, pull up, lock off, pull up, lock off. We look at it in terms of yo-yo, both beaners there with our, um, I believe it's called a Alpine clutch um, rigging that we just learned on the beaner, lock beaners. We have rope going up to what be, um, your pulley carabiner works fine too, and then whatever you're using to ascend. You go, take the slack out, lock off, slack out, lock off, slack out, lock off. The system is the smoothest in taking slack out and locking off, um, but it's the most cumbersome and requires more steps um, involving in descent. So uh, you could do it a number of ways. You could take your weight off this, <clears throat> take all this off, and put in a belay device or a repel device. Uh, you could rig a friction, uh, friction hitch, maybe like a VT above here that you could pull down um, take your weight off of this and then descend with that knot. Uh, again, this is just kind of the bare bones way to, <clears throat> to do it with gear that most people have. Next idea, it involves two beaners. We'll get to that second one in a sec. And a munter hitch, so tire munter. 
where you have um, your two ropes, strands you clip that in, just like that, block your beaner. So now basically we just have your normal muncher hitch going on here. So now you want to take this, <coughs> your down rope, pull it up like it would be going up to the pulley. Take your second beaner. Here we are. And then in this loop, right there, you want to make sure the gates are opposed in this method. We're going to clip through that. Swing it through, clip through the belay loop. Dress everything up. Lock the beaner. Now what you have is a munter that can go one way, not the other. Again, a munter that can go one way, not the other. Now looking at it from a yo-yo standpoint, here we go again. A beaner in place of a pulley and just a regular press of catch in place of a mechanical ascender. Here we have the setup, locked beaners. You're going to stand up, pull the slack out. This one is the hardest to pull the slack out, um, but it will work. Pull the slack out, and then you would sit down, locks off. Again, pull the slack out, sit down, locks it off. One more time, slack out, you would sit down, locks it off. Transitioning to repel in this system is very easy. Um, you go and uh, like you would be pulling up, slack off. You would step up, take your weight off this device, take this beaner that we use to lock the system off, uh, creating a cinch. Simply undo that. And now you're just back into your regular munter. Uh, you can then um, descend with.